Benedict XVI arrived to fanfare in Tel Aviv and was received by the President of Israel, Shimon Peres, and Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. In his first speech on Israeli soil, the Pope said that Jews and Christians share important values like human dignity and respect for religious freedom. The just ordering of social relationships presupposes and requires a respect for the freedom and dignity of every human being whom Christians, Muslims, and Jews alike believe to be created by a loving God and destined for eternal life. The Pope went on to condemn anti-Semitism around the world and said his trip would serve as an opportunity for him to honor the memory of those who lost their lives in the Holocaust. Sadly, anti-Semitism continues to rear its ugly head in many parts of the world. This is totally unacceptable. Every effort must be made to combat anti-Semitism wherever it is found and to promote respect and esteem for the members of every people, tribe, language, and nation across the globe. Benedict will visit the Yad Vashem Memorial, the official memorial dedicated to victims of the Holocaust.